Hello guys, my name is Tarafik. I'm the student of Osh Medical University. Uh, today I, I explain humerus bone. So humerus has a round end and where it meets your shoulder a long shaft in the middle and a flatter end that forms your elbow joints. The upper end has a ball ball shape that uh, fits into your shoulder sockets. The humerus art articulates with scapula at the shoulder end with the radius and ulna to the elbow. And the humerus is a typically descri described as having a proximal region shaft and distal region. Both the anatomical and surgical neck of the humerus are highly susceptible to the fracture. The muscles that move in the, for in the forearm are located along the humerus, which includes the triceps, biceps, bronchi and um, bronchialis and broncho bronchioradialis. There are nine muscles across the shoulder joints to move to move the axial skeleton are the pectoral, uh, pectorals region and the latimus dorsi, the deltoids, uh, sub subcapillaries, uh, supraspinous tendon and infraspinatus. <coughs> tears majors, tears minors and croco and coraco branchialis originate on the scapula. The main function of the humerus bone is to helping your arm move, flex and flex and rotate, holding 13 muscles in place, stabilizing the rest of your arm, including your elbow and hand. Thanks.